Hi Glam Stars, I'm Maddie and welcome to my channel. If you have not yet became an official Glam Star, then all that you have to do is hit that subscribe button in order to become one. We are on the road to 2K and we'd love for you to join the Glam Fam. So go ahead and join by clicking that subscribe button and let's get right into this video. So today I am back for part two of what I eat in a day to keep a flat stomach and you know just to keep my body snatched in general. I made part one and then I was like it's perfect for me to make a part two because obviously what we eat in a day typically changes. The only thing that doesn't really change with what I eat in a day is my breakfast. On the days that I decide to have breakfast, which you should always have breakfast but sometimes I'm just not in the mood for it, that is the only thing that I typically do not change. Now when there is a day that I do change what I eat for breakfast then I will definitely pop in and share that with my glam stars but on today I did not change it. All that I had is avocado on some wheat toast. I had eggs and I also had some turkey bacon and that was the same thing that I had last time I made a video about this. So nothing has changed about that at all. That is my favorite breakfast to have simply because the avocado contains collagen, the eggs contain protein, and the turkey bacon is just better than pork bacon overall. So that is an awesome meal that I like to have for breakfast and it just fills me right up. I had something a little bit different when it came to my lunch and when it came to my dinner and I wanted to pop in and share that with you all and also what I had for a quick little snack. So let's go ahead and get right to the meals that I had on today. Now for lunch I decided that I wanted some nachos and on today I had some organic nachos. Now let me first start by sharing with you all everything that I got from Whole Foods in order to make my nachos. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. Cause everything reminds me of you. I can't take no more. Girl, I think I'm losing my mind. Try to go to work, but I lost track of time. Cause everyone keep looking like you. I can't take no more. I miss your touch from your hands and your body. It hurts. So much to think of you with someone else Can't get enough when you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me Clock and rewind, go back to that moment in time When you say you want me for life, was it all a lie? I gave my all to deserve ya, begging on my knees just to show ya You're the one I want and I love ya, no, 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 no lie I miss your touch from your hands and your body It hurts so much to think of you as someone else Sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me What you need from me Need your love on me Put your love on me I'ma do everything for you I don't want anyone but you Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me
creeping up on me This frostbite gets deep into my bloodstream Just trying to make the most of it Babe, I miss your body Now as you all can see, I already have my pan ready to apply my ground beef in it, so that is what I am currently doing. And after I apply my ground beef in, I'm going to add in my Mexican blend cheese. My mom also added some scallions in here as well. So, yum, yum, yum. I'm so ready, y'all. My mouth is watering watching this. <laughs> and pop it in the oven. I'm going to put the oven on 425. And this will bake for, uh, I would say, about 10 minutes. And then you can take it out and it's ready to eat. Now, with the times that we are living in, you definitely want to have something available to you as to where you can have your food delivered right to your door and you do not have to go to any type of stores and be all around germs, right? So the way that this food was delivered right to my doorstep was through Whole Foods, which is how I'm able to link all these foods down below. You can check it out in my description box. I always have everything linked for my Glam Stars. They deliver the food right to your door that same exact day and all that you do is order from your fingertips at home. So I definitely recommend checking out the Amazon Whole Foods Market. If you use my links down below, please beware that I will earn a small percentage and yeah, it's a way to eat healthier and also to start your own little organic diet. So I absolutely love the way that these nachos came out and there are great reasons why you should start to switch your food over to specifically being organic. And the reasons why are, if you did not know, organic foods are not injected with things to make them bigger. They're not injected with any type of anything to make it more colorful. Organic foods are just all around more healthy for your body and they do not have anything in them to make them appear like what they are not, like their counterparts, of course. Organic foods have fewer pesticides than conventionally grown produce. So that is why I like to purchase organic and I've been on this organic kick recently. So let me go ahead and share with you all how I made my nachos and girl, let me tell you, these nachos were so delicious. I hope that you definitely decide to try them out and if you do, comment down below and let me know. Okay, so for meal number two, I decided to have some salad. So I'm starting off by peeling the eggs that I will be using in my salad. Next after that, I am slicing the eggs that I have already peeled and I had already boiled these before I even started recording so they were all done and all ready and as you all can see I had a struggle peeling some of them out. Okay. 
And this is the eggs after I'm all finished slicing them up. Now I am chopping up some ham. You could use any meat of your choice. I just chose this one because this was the one that was available to me. I'm chopping it up into small little cubes. And keep in mind, I'm cooking for me and my mom, so it's a lot more food than what it would be for just one person. And now here she is washing off the kale to apply in the salad. And now she's also washing the lettuce. And you all do not forget to wash off anything that you will be eating. It's a sour taste, and it's a sour taste to be fooled again, honey. To be fooled again, stole my heart and ripped it into pieces. Yes, you did. You know, it's not the way I planned. No, it's not the way I wanted. No, it's not the things I meant. Know that I'm not being honest. Not the way I wanted us to make it. So here, as you all can see, my mom is now applying the salad to our plates. She's having Thousand Island dressing and I'm having ranch dressing because honey, that is my fave. So I'm just applying that all over my salad. And on today, we will be having some sparkling water. This water is amazing for the body. It prevents binge eating and can also help in weight loss. So if you did not know that, now you know. And here is the finished result after the salad is all finished. And my snack was really simple for today. As y'all know, I've been trying to wean myself off of the junk food because, you know, it just does my body no good. <laughs> so what I had on today was I had some peach, I had some grapes, and I had some strawberries. Now, I'm really not a fan of strawberries, but I decided to throw them in because for those of y'all that do not know, strawberries contain great benefits. And I'm going to share with you all the benefits of everything that I am consuming on today. So let's first start with why it's good to consume grapes. Grapes are packed with nutrients like vitamin C and K. The high antioxidants in grapes can also prevent chronic diseases. Grapes can also benefit your eye health. So those are just a few reasons why you should consume grapes on the day-to-day -day basis. Now we're gonna go ahead and move on to why you should have peaches. Peaches are also packed with nutrients and antioxidants. They can also improve your heart health. Peaches can also reduce allergy symptoms as well. And peaches can also boost your immune system, which is great during the times that we are living in of COVID-19 because we all want to have a strong immune system to fight against the germs and all the sicknesses that are going around. And this is why you should consume strawberries. Strawberries are full of great nutrients as well, and they also contain vitamin C and K. They also give you a good dose of folic acid and potassium. So these are all things that we need to have within our bodies, which is why I try to consume them on the day-to-day -day basis in order to stay healthy. Not only do you girl want to be fine, okay, but I want to be healthy as well. And these are some of the fruits that help you to stay healthy and that also help to keep that body intact. I encourage you to check out part one of this video if you have not seen it already. And I want to thank you all so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you don't have anything else to comment down below, please comment what you are and that is a star. Always remember to keep glamming and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.